Hi, uh, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Um, the weather today um, has been dry mostly um, but cold, um, not really sunny but um, anyway and um, if you could please subscribe to my channel it's a red and white subscription button also um, it's free to subscribe and I upload five times a week and um, also click the notification bell so you never miss a video also um, you can uh, press my join my memberships uh, button which is the blue and white button next to the subscription button um, you can join my memberships for just 99 pence per month uh, for more uh, content and perks just say and there's different levels of perks um, and different prices on there moving on though um the vlog today is going to be travel news uk five exciting facts um april 2021 part two so let's jump right into it www.telegraph.co.uk and um, is first up and Travel news latest, uh, face masks no longer required for sunbathers on Spanish beaches after backlash. The Spanish government has sought to calm tensions over its strict new outdoor face mask rules after they were interpreted uh, by many as uh, meaning they must be worn on the beach at all times so um that's really good news um especially those of you that have already booked it uh, for the, the summer this summer um you won't have to wear a, a face mask on the beach which is good news number two the bbc news say test travel regrime it must be easy and cheap says the prime minister it comes after airlines uh, pay for pre oh it comes it comes after airlines criticize plans to make travelers pay for pre and post travel testing which it, which is not really fair anyway i I personally don't think um, uh, because uh, many other people uh, get it free especially going into these hotels um, or certain hotels just say around the world um, and number three Heathrow at Boss U UK is too cautious on international travel travel industries frustrated by the lack of detail from the government on the 17th of may restart after the covid that's according to uh, the guardian so uh, they're very frustrated um after the 17th of may restart after covid restrictions have eased uh, breaking travel news uh, say wttc fined uk tourism 148 billion loss in 2020 which is a real shame um again i hope um in um the next few years the uk tourism industry can recover from, uh, from this um and the loss um but uh, the last but not least uh, from breakingtravelnews.com number five abita critical of the government support 
um, for travel agents. The Avatar has written uh, to officials at the Department for Business, Energy and Industrial Strategy, uh, BEIS, to protect to protest at the level of grant support being made available to the retail travel industry in England um, which I personally can understand because in my town we have no travel agent shops open now in the town, uh, town centre which is again really disappointing and uh, I, I really feel sorry for um, those, especially in the travel industry, that um, have been made redundant and have to fa find other work, um, particularly travel agencies. Um, again, I really hope that more money goes uh, back into the travel industry and especially opening travel agents uh, shops um, I would love to see in the future um, so people can do what they like um, love doing and have a job also at the same time um, I would like to say thank you for watching um, my next um video is uh, going to be tomorrow and um it's going to be uh, my improvements uh, to my travel and lifestyle updates and more so please uh, keep watching for that and i would like to say bye for now and have a, as good day as possible thank you bye